someone wrote in a comment to one of the videos. I like that you guys use Celsius. It makes you seem like you're smart. Oh. <laughs> and I'm, I'm like, I resisted the urge to say, is that all? Is that all? <laughs> that's, that's the only thing that makes us look smart. It's kind of an insult, right? Kind of uh, backhanded. Yeah. But that's the internet. Mm -hmm. I use Celsius because I'm a scientist and that's what we use in the lab. We do. We do mm -hmm. use it in the lab. Although I haven't done what Vincent is doing. I, I normally don't use it. I guess in, I the, in real life. Yeah, like I know. Inside, outside. I, I have done it for t over 10 years now. And uh, I got it. You know, my phone is converted, my mm -hmm. car, uh, wherever I can convert it. It's really smart of you to sort of just make the jump to doing it all the time so then you, you have don't to. have to think differently about yeah. temperatures in different locations and i probably should do the same but have never quite yeah gotten I, there. so that, I, that's why i wanted to do it but also you get used to what 20c feels like and 25 you know it's a very compressed scale i know that's what a lot of people complain about but it's the it is what it is i love that it's zero to 100 right? it's great i love all metric systems us is one of the only countries in the world that doesn't use metric systems in everyday it's life. True. I don't know why we couldn't do it. I will say the one thing though is when it's winter and it's super cold, it it's 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 nice to be above zero. <laughs> it's like something about <laughs> five degrees Fahrenheit doesn't quite feel as cold. <laughs> yeah, I understand. <laughs>